grow with him today. We just love you, God, and we just yeah. thank you. Yes. Thank yes. you for bringing us here safely. Yes. And thank you for just taking care of us all year. Yes, Lord. Yes. Yes. We just want to say thank you, thank you, thank, thank you. We just can't uh, thank you enough for allowing us to be here today and to worship in the house of the Lord. Yes, Lord. And Lord, uh, thank you for just uh, looking over us all week long, Lord. Yes. Yes. Thank, thank you for uh, for our jobs, our house, our home. Yes. We thank just you. so grateful, Lord, what yes. you have done. Yes. 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 Just thank you and praise you for us. Yes, Lord. Yes, because you are the only true God, one yes. only true God. Yes, Lord. Lord. And yes. we're just so grateful to have you in our in our lives. Lord. Yes. 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 And when we go through trials and tribulations, thank you for bringing thank us you. through, thank Lord. You. Yes, Lord. Just thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank, thank you, Lord. We just can't give you enough praise, Lord, for what yes. you have brought us through, Lord. And we just here to give you the praise and the glory yes. that you so deserve, Lord. Yes. Yes. Just thank you, thank you, thank you for seeing growth. Thank you for our visitors today, Lord. And we hope that you learn something from the lesson that the uh, our, our leader will, will bring across this pulpit yes, this morning Lord. so you yes, can learn and share with others, Lord Jesus. And yes, we just Lord. thank you, thank you, thank, thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked and even my enemies came upon me into my flesh, they stumbled and fell. Though an host to the camp against me, my heart shall not fear. Not fear. Not fear. Though the war should rise against me, and this will not be confident. One thing I have desired of the Lord that I will seek after. That I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, and to behold the beauty of the Lord, and to fight in his temple. I read the Psalm 27, 1 through 4. May the Lord ever bless us to read it and hear it on your Bless us not to be just readers, bless us to be hearers and doers also. All right, all right. Amen. Amen.
Hallelujah. He done seen you. Listen, watch this. God done seen if you were able to see some of the unseen dangers that God blocked you away from and he detoured you from. You won't have to worry about no preacher telling you to say nothing for God. You be running around and shouting.
saying, but you trying to prove something, amen, getting yourself in hockey, man. Yeah. But, amen, that's not, they were struggling, and you ain't even got the money, but there you go, trying to impress somebody or something, you know, all that foolishness, amen. Last time I checked, it was, it was Jesus' birthday. Hallelujah. And the Bible records that them three wise men came from the east, they came from a long way just to worship him. And he, they gave him their very best. Man, I, I was struggling, I was struggling in between this, this message this morning that he gave me, man. But because we're at the cusp of this new year, amen, uh, and overseer, he, he touched on it real good last week. But I had, he gave me something that passage he preached last week. Uh, related, related to the, the wise men because uh, uh, Satan, um, the Satan, the Satan that was in Herod thought he was fooling them. Yeah. And here's the irony of the thing: they wise men. Yeah, 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 yeah. They were wise men. Yes, hallelujah. That meant they had some sense, but why? Yeah. <laughs> they just, they just went Joe Blow from Cuckoo Hall. Hey, man, they, they knew something. Yeah. They ain't telling them you should go find him. Come back to me so I don't worship him too. <laughs> they didn't even feel that. Yeah, yeah. Overseer preached that out last week. Mm -hmm. I told him over the phone. He said, Well, Dr. Wolf's on there. I said, Well, bless your heart. Yeah. I said, All right, pray for me. And I was sharing that with him. I said, Doc, you, you gave me something. I pulled something off of what you talked about. All right, all right. I said, Yeah, I said, um, The wise men came from afar. To worship him, I said, and many people don't realize the fact that when they, by the time they got there, mm. amen, that they were no longer in the in the manger. Yeah, yeah. They were no longer in the stable. Yeah. Amen. amen. For those that don't know the Bible amen. and yeah. in, in conclusiveness, they were no longer in the stable. Mm. By the time the wise men got there, they were in a house. Yes, amen. Lord. Yes, amen. Yes, and he was no longer that little baby yeah. wrapped in the swaddling clothes. Yeah. All right. Bible records that it says that when they had reached the house where the young lad and his mother and father were, right. they presented him gifts. Yeah. Yeah. And I told him, I said, man, I, I, you gave me something out of that. I said, because it seems like the, the text said that, it said that they gave him gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Mm -hmm. Those were priceless. Those are priceless gifts. Those are yeah. gifts of uh, uh, only royalty, kingship, and whatnot had. Amen. I said, man, I like the thought of what's your best gift to Jesus. Oh, Hallelujah. 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 That that preach one, Mama. Amen. 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 What's your best gift? Yes. To give to Jesus. Uh -huh. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna save it. Now, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna save it. He, he gave me something else too. Amen. I'm gonna save it, but. But that, 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 the reality of that, mm -hmm. what would be your best yes, gift yes. to give to Jesus? Hallelujah, hallelujah. I'm going to just let, I'm going to just put it in your lap and let hallelujah. you put it in your pocket, take it home, I mean. marinate. There you go. That, that, what you say? Tell me, tell me, get my man on. Me. Me, amen. Yeah. Your best gift yes, yes. that you could ever give yes. to Jesus. Yes. Need be yes. you. Yes, yes. Not half of you. Yes, all. Not a piece of you. All. Not a part of you. All. But all of you. Yes. Amen. Yes. That, was, uh, that was the one that hopped in my head at first. Yes. I mean, he gave me something else, amen. Something that's conclusive for this year going out and this year coming in. Amen. Yes. Amen. But uh, to the end, amen. We want to even hold that perspective that whatever we do, for God, let it be the best. Yes, Amen. Yes, Amen. Yes, Amen. Yes, I mean, just real talk. Just let it be the best. Yes, and then here we go. Here we go. Because if you're a real person, you don't want nobody giving you something that number one they don't want to give you. Amen. I know I don't. Right. You, if you're trying to do it for me and you don't really want to, do it, God bless you. Keep it. Yes. I don't want it because yes. you're giving it to me the wrong way. Amen. Yes. And if we feel that way, how do you think God feels? That's right. Get on over here and see them grow one more time. They, they are all awesome. yeah. God deserves better than that, man. Yeah. Yeah. Now, hey, blessings to Hey, glory to God. He deserves better than that. Yeah, yeah. 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 Let your, what you give God be your best. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. 
see how God will at the time bless you. Yes, he Amen. will. Yes, he will. Amen. Y'all want to sing the one more time? Let's do it all right. All right, choir. Right. 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 Well, I think he's still working on something. <laughs> amen, amen. Amen. So we can go ahead on and move on. Let's go and move on our tithes and offering, amen, and we get that out the way. Amen. 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 The Bible records, will a man rob God? Amen. The answer to that question is a resounding and a very loud yes. Yes, Lord. Yeah, he will and yeah, he do rob God. Yeah. Where with have we? How do we rob you? How, how, how mm. do we rob you? The Bible says, and tie that in office. Yes. For this you're cursed with the curse. So people don't understand why they don't have no money from next from payday to payday. Yeah. Because well, you ain't honoring God. Amen. It's real simple. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. It ain't what I said, it's what the word says. Amen. He says, he continues on to say, he said, Bring ye all the tithes yes, yes. into the storehouse, yes. that there may be meat in my house. Yes, he says, Prove me now herewith, yes. saith the Lord of hosts, that if I will not open the window of heaven yes, yes. and pour out upon you a blessing that you will not have room enough yes. to receive. Right. That simply says, and I would play tongue and tongue, tongue and speech. Uh, uh, don't rob God. Hallelujah. Honor God. Hallelujah. Bless Him with the gifts that He gave you. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And trust Him yes. at His word. Amen. Yes. Yes. And Hallelujah. see if God will not supply your needs All right. for you. Amen. 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 We all have our envelopes. Everyone have the offer to prepare. Yes. Amen. If you need an envelope, raise your hand. Us will give you one. Amen. And as we have our gifts, let's elevate them to God this morning. Amen. The action and elevating to God that we want God to bless it. Amen. Amen. So we don't want to just put it in an envelope. We don't want to just take it out of our pocket and just drop it in the bucket. We want God to bless it. Amen. Amen. Whatever it may be, we know that He is a God that He can multiply. Can I get a witness? Yes. Yes. Whatever you have, amen. And you give it with the right spirit. He will yes. bless it. Amen. Amen. Yes. Father God, with these gifts that we raise them to you now, we pray that you bless these gifts. Oh God, bless the one that holds the hand elevated to you with the gift. We pray, oh God, that you would, as you said in your word, open the window of the heaven and pour us out blessings. That we won't have room enough to receive. Then, like minds of God, you said you will make men give unto our bosom, press yes, down, yes. shaking together and running over. We Thank won't you. obey you and we won't obey your word. Yes. And in doing such, oh God, you said you love a cheerful giver. Yes. Now let one pantry go by, go empty, oh God, let no one miss a meal, oh God, is being obedient to your word and is our worshiping you with our gifts. That one that had not, we pray that you bless them as well yes, to be able yes, to give it yes, to the time, knowing that it was you that gave them the increase. We yes, love you and we thank you and bless your name for it all. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And thank God in the hands of the usher.
Sunday we have to go to work. <clears throat> you don't like that, amen. 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 Because he'd rather be in the house of God, amen. 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 Likewise, I would be as well. But then he has to work. Amen. 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 Lot of able bodied fellas walking around. Yes, <laughs> I mean, I don't know, I won't get in trouble with anybody. Amen. 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 But he has to go to work because his heart is always here. Amen. Amen. Yes. He wrote a salutation and he wanted us to read it for him in his absence for us today. Amen. Dear C. Grove, it is the last Sunday of the year, 2019. We head into 2020. Amen. And we head into 2020. Amen. And we head into 2020. Amen. God has been good to us yes. and faithful. Yes. yes. Adjustments and rebuilding during this season. I commend each and every one of you for your continued faith in Christ. Faithfulness to the ministry and support of me doing also this time. I pray that we will continue to support and love one another as we work together in kingdom building. Cedar Grove has come a long way. Cedar Grove has come a long way. Just believe that the best is yet to come. As we prepare to install and present the auxiliary leadership next Sunday, let us pray. Let us pray that the ministry leadership will be prayerful, sincere, and work with the people given to their care. Yes, yes, hallelujah. God has called mm. you to lead. Yes. For those of you in leadership. Yes. His people not lords over them. Yes. Love them. Yes. And treat them with the respect and like the phoenix that rose from the ashes. Yes. Today we can go to great heights in Christ. Yes. May God bless and keep you in his care and I'll see you in 2020. Amen. In the last service, Reverend John and Mosley Overseer. Let's give God a hand. Thinking much of you enough, amen, to send salutations even in his absence on an auspicious day such as today, amen. Yes. That's a blessing, and we thank God for the gift of him, amen. amen. I said, We thank God for the gift of him. Amen. Amen. With the interest of your prayers.
And all that came into Solomon's heart to make in the house of the Lord and in his own house, he prosperously effected. And the Lord appeared to Solomon by night and said unto him, I have heard thy prayer and have chosen, say chosen, Chosen. This place to myself for an house of sacrifice. Verse 13. If I shut up heaven that there be no rain, or if I command the locusts to devour the land, or if I send pestilence among my people. Say my people. My people. If my people. Say if my people. If my people. If my people which are called by my name. Say my name. My name. Shall humble. Say humble. humble. Themselves and pray. Say pray. Pray. And seek my face. Say seek. Seek. And turn from their wicked ways. Say wicked ways. Wicked ways. Then then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Now mine eyes shall be open and mine ears attend unto the prayer that is made in this place. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God keep you. Thank you so much for your respect and honest to the author and to the word of God. I believe this to be the word of God. Amen. Amen. I believe it to be the word of God and I present it to us this morning in that fashion. As the gospel writer recorded before one jot oh, one tittle mm. of this word shall pass away heaven and earth shall pass away but the word of our God shall stand for ever. All right. And I believe that to be so. And if you believe that to be so, just wave your hands to the Lord with me and just say, even this day. Even this day. Even this day. By way of subject, not going to be with us long. <clears throat> By way of subject, Look at your neighbor. If you don't have a neighbor, look at someone. Someone you can look in the eye of. Amen. Tell them when New Year's coming. New Year's coming. New Year's coming. New Year's coming. New Year's Lord. Bishop's going to give us a formula. Bishop's going to give us a formula. For the New Year. For the New Year. A formula. A formula. For the new year. For the new year. God bless you. All right. Solomon, the writer here, records this passage of scripture <laughs> in the perspective of having done a monumental deed for God. Mm -hmm. He did something that was monumental. He did something that was grand. Can I get a witness? Amen. He did something that most folk could not, would not, Amen. nor even think about doing. trying to do. Amen. He did something major. Hmm. He did something that pleased. God. Yeah. All right. He did something that he knew God would get the glory out of. Right. Yes, right. yes. He did something that he knew that God would appreciate and be thankful for the fact of that he did what he did. Amen. All right. Amen. All right. He did something that only God could have blessed him, watch this, to do. Yes, yes. Yes, he was king. Hallelujah. 
Yes, he was king. Yeah. But God enabled him, watch this, <laughs> to do this grand thing that he did. Okay. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. What did he do, Bishop? What, what, what did he do? I'm glad you didn't ask. I'm glad to do it. <laughs> what he did was, bless God, God allowed Solomon to rebuild the temple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Temple had been made to be in ruins. Mm -hmm. Temple had been uh, ran down and ran over. The Medes and the Persians had came and declared war against the Israelites and even took many of them, amen, uh, to exile and slavery. But the temple yes, yes. was, amen, demolished. Hallelujah. But in the fact of it being demolished, King Solomon had a heart for God. Hallelujah. Can I get a witness? As much as he had a heart for God, he had a heart also for the people and the things yes. of God. Yes. It bothered his heart that the temple was in ruins. They couldn't go worship as they would often do. Yeah. Ask God to atone for their sins. You know, back then, culture was that when you messed up, then you had to go and sacrifice. Yeah. Are you with me? Yeah. Amen. When you messed up before God, when you told that lie, or when you, hey, amen, back bit on somebody, amen, y'all know some of the stuff we do. Don't, don't try it like, don't try it like it's all, you know, it's all gravy, amen. We, we got some stuff, me too, amen. All have sin, Paul said, and come short. That's book. Stay with me, amen. They couldn't go worship. They couldn't go and, and, and atone for the, the sins and they, as they would, would regularly do. Solomon rebuilt the temple. Yes, yes. He prayed and he asked God to give him perspective to be able to do all that was within his heart. Now we do, I must admonish us to the simple fact, uh, Solomon was rich. Amen. On top of being the king. Can I get a witness? So he had the means and he had the provisions. Amen. Bible records that when he finished erecting, building this temple, rebuilding, he said it says that it was the most beautiful house yes, yes. that had ever been erected in the name of God. Yes, yes. It was the most beautiful of temples. Adorned with every fine uh, uh, every finery that would could be found in in its tapestry and jewelry and 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 and, 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 and upholstery and, and even in diamond and in diamonds and in pearls and in gold and in silver. In other words, he spared no expense. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Yes. He did what we should do, which is he gave. God is best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gave God his best. And that's what we ought to do as Christians, yeah. whatever we do. Can I get a witness? Yeah. For God, it ought to be our best. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I know sometimes when we do for each other, we may not put our best effort forward. Can I get a witness? Oh, here you go. I gotta go over here and help this Negro again. And she ain't gonna even halfway say thank you. Amen. Come on, talk back to me. Amen. Because so that's how we do it. Amen. Oh, my brother. Oh, God, my sister. Look, call somebody else. Why call? Don't call me. Do what you would do if I wanted. Y'all know. And when we do what we do for them, it's not sometimes always our best. Our best. But whatever we do for God ought to be our best. Truly our best. Solomon gave his best and did his best to God in the rebuilding of the temple. But as he finished mm. building it, yes. Scripture records that as he began to pray to God, he prayed to God and he said to God that 
as much as I have built and rebuilt the temple in your name, mm, yes. your house for your glory and for your honor, yes. if thy do not bring thy spirit yes, yes. and thy presence upon this temple, yes. as beautiful as it is, and yes. all this splendor that it is. Yes, yes. Without your spirit nor your presence, it will just be a big, beautiful, empty building. In other words, it just be pretty. Yes. Just be nice. That's the temple being to be the temple. Yes. But anywhere, watch this, that the spirit of God is supposed to dwell, you show up with one. church every Sunday and felt no spirit of God. Amen. Talk back to me, somebody. Amen. You know, there are some churches that don't have no spirit of God working in. I, I ain't bad now for no, no churches or nothing, yeah. but it's just the truth. Amen. You got some churches that don't really worship God. Yeah. And they can't worship God if His presence isn't there. Can I get a witness? Yeah. But when we come to worship, our worship supposed to be that we come Yes, Amen. He does. Amen. 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 Yes. When you pray, yes. 
Yes. He does. Yes, he hear does. you. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. He hears you yes, he when you pray. That's yes. right. That's right. But on top of that, how many know that he'll answer? Yeah. 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 It's one thing to pray knowing that he hears. Yes. But it's something totally more and different to know that he will answer. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah. And when he answers, bless his name, yeah. Yeah. he will respond. He's not a man of God. He loved God. He served God. He 
He's a man after God's own heart, just like his daddy David was. Amen. He loved God and he did something to please God. And now he's praying, Father, please allow your spirit, allow your presence to rain down rest upon the temple. That it not just be a big, pretty place, but that it be a place that was erected for you. And for you alone. <laughs> and he prayed. Yes. And he prayed. Yes. And God answered yes. Yes. his prayer. Amen. <laughs> now the formula is in, watch this, the prayer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some of us want the blessing hmm. without doing the work it takes to get the blessing. Yes. Am I preaching to anybody? I'm talking to somebody. Hey, well, some of us want the blessing from God, but we don't want to make no, we don't want to put the time in. We don't want to put the footwork in, bless his name, in order to receive the blessing from God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. The formula rests within the very the very works of the prayer. Yes, yes. <laughs> the ingredients for the formula is in the midst of the prayer. To realize and to recognize not only what who you are and whose you are, but God says, watch this, He can identify you for you for you if you don't want to identify for yourself. God says in my people. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. But you call by my name. Yeah. Would humble them say yeah, yeah. and pray. Yeah, yeah. Breathe the wine so I'm sorry, to, I'm sorry to tell you that, amen, but sometimes, you know, the truth hurts. Can I get a witness? Amen. You know, we, we live in this age and, 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 and this time where everything is given to me now. Amen. You know, we're under the microwave scenario, amen. amen. And uh, whatever gets done, we want to do it right now. We don't want to do no work for it. We don't want to make no effort toward it. We don't want to do nothing to, that's pleasing to make it happen. We want it all right now. But see, if you're going to go into 2020, yes, yes. Hallelujah, and then you are going to go into 2020 yes. in expectation of all of the blessings from God. Yes. What you knew, what you knew, what you know, what you know, you need to know that the only and receive the blessings that he has for you is if you do it his way. Do I have a witness anybody? Yes, I know, I know that we all know how to pray. But are we really praying? You see, it ain't about just, Lord, I need you. Can you do it? No, no, that ain't true. That ain't true. We need to get to the place of understanding that sometimes to lay before God. And I know there might be something that some of us don't understand, but, but sometimes we need to learn how to just go prostrate. Yeah. Yeah. Lay before the Lord. That's a total submission. Can I get a witness? That's total submission. And line even know, I know that I don't have the strength to get what I need from you, but I know before you. Not only will you hear, but you will answer prayer. Grandmama used to say it like this. When the little prayer wheel gets to turning, then you know that the, that the power's turning. How could you say that? She said, just a little talk with Jesus. We'll make it all to leave y'all alone. God bless you this morning. And God keep you in my prayer. But as I leave you, see the grow. I cannot leave you without giving you the fullness of the formula. Someone say hallelujah. Jesus said, God said, if my people, he took ownership. Can I get a witness? Should do something. 
He'll turn your situation around. He'll turn your darkness into day. Can I get a witness? He'll turn your morning into joy. Can I get a witness? He'll turn your frown into a smile. He'll give you happiness when sadness exists. He'll turn it around. I say he'll turn it around. Formula for a new year. Pray. Pray. You better not try to go into 20 without praying. You better pray. And make sure that he's hearing you. Pray. And make sure that you got a true connection with God. Don't you try to go into 2020 without God. Hallelujah. Seek his face. Yes, yes. Just like you're looking for that five dollar bill you lost this morning. You don't know where it's at, but you're searching for it. You searching for it with all diligence. You throwing stuff all out in your area. You looking for it. Yeah. Look for God the same way going in 2020. Yeah. Somebody talk back to me here. Go look at search for God like you're searching for something dead. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes, yes. Turn from everything that you know that ain't like God. That's right, that's Preacher ain't gotta tell you. That's right. You know what it is. Right. I said you know what it is. Right. You know what's hindering you. Yeah. Yes. That's right. yeah. Turn <laughs> from your wicked way. All right, all right. He said then. Yes. And only then yes. will I hear from heaven. That's right, that's right. I will hear yes. from heaven. Yes, yes. I will forgive yes. their sins. Yes, Lord. And I will heal yes. the land. Yes. 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 This orange fella called the president. Hallelujah. Told a lie. Buying votes from the American people. Yes. He made a slogan that suggested it was a good slogan, that's why he used it. He just didn't live up to it. He suggested to make America great again. I didn't know it wasn't still great. Amen. Still a great nation. We still, can I get a witness? Can I get a witness? Let's make America great again. Maybe he was talking about the Republic Party. Amen. Amen. You know, some of them, you know, some of them had some deficiencies. You know, yeah. their money got messed around with. You know, so I guess that's who he was talking about. Yeah. Yeah. It don't matter what, brother. Brother Trump does. Amen. God's in control. I'm here to tell you this morning. Mm. See the grove. Yes, yes. Beautiful people of Cedar Grove. Hallelujah. Your brother Bishop Darby just want to put this in your lap as we go into 2020. Yes, yes. It don't matter what Trump did or said. Amen. He said let's make America great again. America still great. Yes. And it's going to be great when he get out of the way. Amen. Hallelujah. It don't matter what he say or do. If you apply the principles of this book right here, not only will you be a great perspective in making America great again, you will be the essence of the fruit of why it's still great. Hallelujah. of this passage of scripture. Yes. If my people which are called by my name yes. should humble themselves yes. and pray yes. and seek my faith yes. and turn from their wicked ways. Yes. God said yes. then yes. 
will I hear from heaven. I will forgive their sins. God said, not Solomon. Solomon ain't got the power. God was Solomon ain't got the power to power for that. Just say He needed to save it himself. Can I get a witness? God said, I will forgive their sins. And I will heal their hands. Let's give God a hand.